Hi guys, so in this video I'm going to show you how to create this double layer video editing using InShot Video Editor. So guys, this tutorial is going to be simple and straightforward. So make sure you watch the video all to the end. And if you find this video helpful, make sure you hit the like button, comment down below and subscribe to the channel because 98% of my viewers here aren't subscribed to the channel. So guys, please support the channel by subscribing to the channel. It really means a lot to me and it's going to motivate me to keep creating tutorials like this. So with that being said, let's dive right into the video. So guys, open in short and create any video project. Now select a blank clip. Now let's increase the duration to around 21 seconds. You can go to duration and edit the duration to 21 seconds. Now let's go to PIP and add our first photo. Now select the image, make it full screen then move it to the top now increase the image duration to around 7 seconds now let's copy it copy it then replace it with your second image now select the image now this is the second photo we want to use for the WAR video editing now move it to the bottom and slightly above the first one now let's go to mask, select the linear mask, now invert the mask, then place the mask tool at the top, now drag the shadow key. As you can see, we have blended both images together, now see the results. So just repeat the same steps for all your images. So guys. So as not to waste your time, I'm going to repeat the same process for the other images. Now I've done that and this is the result. Now let's go to music, audio and add our music. And you can select any of your favorite music and add it to the video. Now delete the part you don't want from the audio. So right now I will split and delete the front parts. Then adjust the position of the music so you can play the music and listen to the music lyrics. So now let's go to the ending parts. Also, you can split and list the ending parts. Split and delete. Perfect. Now export the video. So after exporting the video, create a new video project with the video we just saved. Now here is the video. Now let's add some effects to it. Now go to effects, video effects. Go to retro and select this black and white frame effect. I can adjust the value to your preference. Now click the effect to the hand. So guys, let's add one more effect and go to the effects. Now locate stylize. Now under stylize, you will see the HDR effect. Now add it to it. Then adjust the value to your preference. Now clip the effect to the hand. Now let's move on to the final part, which is adding captions to the video. Now you can do this by using InShot captions. Now go to text and select captions. Now select the template you would like to use. So for this, I'll use this typewriter style effect. Now start generating the captions. So wait for the captions to generate. And when it is done generating, here is the final result. Thank you so much for watching. Much love like that for you. 
and i will see you in the next video peace